Corner. He stands at 185 centimeters tall, weighing in at 94.1 kilos, holding a mixed martial arts record of 14 wins and two losses. Training out of Long Yun MMA, representing China. Stepping into action is King Kong Warrior Fan Rom. And introducing his opponent out of the red corner, he is a former one middleweight world champion, standing at 184 centimeters tall and weighing in at 94.3 kilos, holding a mixed martial arts record of 10 wins and 2 losses, training out of Ahmad Fight Team, representing Russia, get ready for retaliation. Big Dash! And when the action begins, your referee in charge, Mr. Olivier Cost. All right, guys, watch out for the headbutt. Low blow, back of the head and spine. Five fair, five clean. Touch go if you want and buy your corner. Fan Rong says Vitaly Big Dash has no chin. He's fragile and easily broken. Vitaly Big Dash, the former middleweight world champion, says Fan Rong cannot handle right, just, his athleticism. Just, just time. Ready? Ready? Talk! We don't expect this one to go the distance. Two big units inside the circle right now. Fan Rong will try and plant that right hand on the inside. <laughs> Van Ronk says he wants to look for a takedown early, and there it is. He looked for he changed levels, but good defense coming from Vitaly Big Dash. Rib kick there from Big Dash in the blue. Van Ronk's known as a big puncher with some serious power in that right hand. I'd expect Vitaly Big Dash to really start laying in the kicks, start utilizing the kicks and keep him at that distance. Outside leg kick, second one of the year. round so far for Big Dash. Hitting that common peroneal nerve just above the knee. One way to slow down the punchy prowess of Fun Rong, who shoots in for an attempted takedown. But Big Dash will have none of that. Yeah, there's another takedown attempt coming from Fan Rong. He's gonna, he might have to adjust to plan B, which is going to be more of a boxing range that he wants to adjust and then set up that takedown a little bit better because Vitaly Big Dash has good takedown defense as we've seen in the past. Vitaly Big Dash is coming off of a big win over against Nimura where he locked in a nasty reverse triangle arm bar. You remember that? I do. Nice overhand right there from Fan Rong. Looking confident here, the Chinese athlete spinning back elbow, Big Dash. A little acrobatic in there, striking outside leg kick, Fan Rong. And Big Dash just said, no, nothing in that. Got to do better. Open trade round kicks to the body. Hooks up the leg, take down there from Big Dash. Fan Rong going to get a hold of the arm for the arm bar. Wow, immediately dropped into an arm bar. Big Dash looks like he's got his elbow almost past. He might be safe. Fan Rong might have to adjust, transition to something else. You can see now he's got the arm out. That was a lightning fast submission coming from Fan Rong after he slammed him. Good job by Vitaly Big Dash to work with the pass. Are you surprised how quick Fan Rong hooked onto that arm? Yeah, that was lightning fast off of the slam from Big Dash. This is where Big Dash likes to be. He likes to sit in the guard and just kind of hammer on people until they sort of uh, allow him to pass and work into a more dominant position. But Fan Rong's got good jujitsu off of his back. There was a time when Vitaly Big Dash was one of the most feared fighters in all of one championship when he held the gold that was eventually taken from him by Ong Lan Sang. Somewhat controversially, Big Dash argues that he believes he beat Ong Lao that night. If he wins tonight, you figure maybe we will see a trilogy match between Ong Lao and Vitaly. And you've also got the middleweight king, RDR, looking for his next opponent too. So with a big knockout win or a big submission, Big Dash could put his name right into contention for that title. Same with Fan Rong though. 
Especially how fast Van Rong slapped onto that submission. Right, Jab to right hand there from Fan Rong drifts back to center circle. 130 remains. First round of three. Judged as an overall 15 minute contest, and not as three individual rounds. A lot of feints coming from Fan Rong. I like that. I'd like to see him go back to that low kick, too. I mean, just glance the target area on the chin of Fan Rong. Looks for a double leg takedown, does Vitali. Fan Rong stuffs it, tries to pump it up a gut. Front kick there from Vitali. Body shot from the big Russian. The Russians are one on one tonight. A loss to Yusuf Sadalayev against Stefan Lohman. A win for Ramazanov over Sebastian Katastar. Another double leg attempt here from Big Dash. Good defense so far from Fan Rong, but Vitali was able to run him over and secure that double leg. Let's see what Vitali can get here off his back or off the top. Fan Rong is going to the butterfly hook. See how he has his legs on the inside of the thighs of Vitali Big Dash. He's going to try to create a little bit of elevation. Cracks down with the elbow does Vitali lowers himself again. Foot on hips here from Fun Rong. Vitali trying to work the left hand to the side of the Chinese athlete's head. Where does Fun Rong go from here, Dragon? Well, he's got one foot on the hips, so he's going to be able to create a little bit of space. See how he's elevating Big Dash? But then Big Dash can That's twist his hips to pop those legs off so he can settle back down into the guard. Big Dash loves this position when he starts dropping that ground and pound good way for big dash to end the first five big dash the former middleweight oh, world champion oh. fun wrong who would love a crack at the gold hell by renya de ritter of holland boring with that lead hand the russian fakes off the back leg does vitali Good smacking right there. Didn't turn the knuckles over, but it was a slap, wasn't it? Yeah, that? nice parry. You could see Big Dash left his lead hound out there a little too long, and Fan Rong was able to parry it down and come over with his right hand. He needs to do more of that. He needs to keep that right hand active and busy, especially when Big Dash closes that distance. Oh, spinning heel kick. How do you do from Vitali? The big fella winds up. And a rib kick from Vitali, Big Dash. Counters over the top, there's Fun Rong. Vitali getting more aggressive now. Turning up the aggressive meter in the strike. In the former world champion. Double leg takedown attempt. And Fun Rong stops it. Good takedown attempt there to get in nice and deep. But it was a good defense on the first one. Let's see how he handles the second one here. Big Dash is in on the legs. He's got his hands clasped and he gets him down. Nice work from Vitali Big Dash. Folks, don't forget, still to come, double main event. Philippines versus the world. Belignon, Juan Juan Hill, Danny Kingat, and Kyrat Akhmatov. Van Rong's good off his back. He's got the butterfly hooks. He's got an active guard. He's not just trying to keep him in close guard and hold on to the position waiting for a stand-up. He's trying to stay active, look for submissions, and create stand-ups. Big Dash thought about grabbing the leg onto the leg there. It looks like Fun Rong's going after the leg now. Looks like he's got that Ashigarami, that leg entanglement. He's going after a heel hook. Good defense from Vitali Big Dash to separate the legs, get the leg off the hip and turning. Look at Fan Rong getting deep into that heel hook. Vitali Big Dash might be able to float over that he does. Oh, but Fan Rong blocks the leg and prevents him from spinning. But good adjustment by Vitali. Fantastic ground battle here in the th second round of three. Try the heel hook. How painful are those, Dragon? You've been uh, had a heel hook slapped on you? Yeah, by Shinya. It's terrifying. By Shinya? Your career like think of flashes. Worse. You're like the movement for the rest of your life flashes before your eyes. It's horrible. It's horrible. What is Vitaly looking to do here, Dragon? I think he's just trying to settle into this position. You can see how Fan Rong's sitting there in half guard. Right, he's almost working his way past, but he's got that butterfly hook. I like how he utilizes these butterfly hooks to create movement. He's not just stagnant in his guard. He's always trying to stay active, utilizing overhooks and underhooks with his arms to create that movement and also control the posture of Vitali Big Dash. Vitali likes that left elbow. Forearm across the throat here of Fan Rong at the moment. Rear elbow then. Cracks it with the knuckles off the right. Shoots to the left hand as Vitali. Ooh, and a fist strike to the body there from Vitaly Big Dash. Goes body and head, and there's an elbow again from the big Russian. You can see 
Fan Wong's flat on his back. He doesn't want to stay there. He's got to try to get off onto his side and create that movement. You can see Big Dash, this is what I was talking about. You asked me what he, Big Dash needed to do. He's so hard to deal with when he's on top of you. He's so strong, he's so powerful, he's got really heavy hips, and he can just control your position, and then he picks his shots very carefully. He's not just flailing on you, he makes sure each one counts. Oh, his elbows, trying to crack the bridge of the nose of Fan Rong. <laughs> Panrong's got to stop him from posturing up and landing those salvos. Here he goes again. There's another elbow. Cracks him on the orbital just under the right eye. See, he's got to try to get onto his side. There you go. Create a little bit of movement, create a little bit of space. But he's having a hard time doing it. He's got the butterfly hooks. Now he's got a butterfly guard. He's got an overhook on one side. Let's see if he can create a little bit of movement here. He's got 60 seconds to do something. I wonder if Vitaly wasn't playing some some games with Fun Rong. It seems to say something to the Chinese athlete before he landed that big elbow. Maybe trying to get in Fun Rong's mind here. Fun Rong almost got the sweep, almost created that space, but he wasn't quite quick enough on the get up. Good control from Vitaly Big Dash to stay on top and start dropping those hammers. Just getting confirmation, Dragon. Vitaly actually asked Fan Rong, are you good? And I think Fan Rong said yes, and then Vitaly cracked him with an elbow. Well, are you good now? <laughs> You're good then. You ain't, won't be soon. <laughs> Trying to pin that leg. Half guard here for Vitaly. Big Dash goes to the waist. There's the elbow again. Those elbows are measured. Well, it's almost like a mounted position. You can see he's only kind of has that knee shield. Early. And then we're back on January 14 for heavy hitters. Did you call that vertical Muay Thai? Yeah. Isn't horizontal? Oh, yeah. Not on the ground. Oh, my gosh. A rare mistake when you called me on a dragon. Good job. I applaud you. Left hook, right hand there from Fun Rong. High kick from Big Dash. He used the high kicks well at the start of the second round. We saw a spin back kick, a spin heel kick from the Russian. Now Fun Rong on top position. Guillotine. Guillotine here by Big Dash. Has he got a dragon? Let's see. He's got the arm in. Guillotine, a lot of plan, a lot of pressure to the head. It looks like it's pretty deep there. Vitaly Big Dash taps out Fan Rong at the start of the third round with a guillotine. Beautifully done from the former world champion. Wow, Fan Rong went in for a takedown. Vitaly Big Dash jumped on the arm and guillotine, applied the squeeze. You could see his head was deep into that choke, and he just started cranking and got the tap. The Russians finish the night. Two and one wins to Big Dash. Ladies and gentlemen, your referee, Mr. Olivier Cost, has called a stop to this contest after 41 seconds in the third round for your winner. By way of guillotine choke, Vitaly Big Dash! Vitaly Big Dash is back.